Hello everyone. In this problem, we will be looking at resistive forces. A resistive force generally is defined as a force that resists the motion of an object in a given medium. And a, the most common example of a resistive force is air resistance. Though there are different scenarios or circumstances in which resistive forces exist, friction is another example of a resistive force. Now, in this problem, a bullet of mass M is fired into a block of length L. So we are required to derive an expression of the speed of the bullet in the block as a function of time. Now, it is always advisable to begin such a problem by doing a free body diagram. So if we have the block, this is the direction of motion. The only force acting in the opposite direction of motion is the resistive force. FR. You have the width of the block. You have the normal force. And there is no force acting in the forward direction. So from Newton's second law, the summation of F is equal to MA, which means that 0 minus FR is equal to m dv dt. Therefore, minus bv is equal to m dv dt. You can rewrite this as dv dt plus b over m v equal to zero this is the differential equation required by the problem now the next question says we need to derive an expression for the speed of the bullet while inside the block as a function of time what do we know we know that m dv dt is equal to negative bv which basically means that dv dt is equal to negative b over m all multiplied by v so how do we solve this differential equation to solve this differential equation, we need to separate the variables. So we are going to take all the terms that contains V to one side of the equation and the terms that contains T to the other side of the equation. And this means that you will end up with V divided by V equal to negative B over M multiplied by DT. So if we take the integral of both sides, that's the integral from V naught to V of dV over V, all of this will be equal to negative B over M, the integral from zero to T of dT. And this is just gonna be negative BT all divided by M. Looking at the right hand side, this is the integral of the absolute value of v from v naught to v. All of this equal to negative bt over m, which implies that we have the integral of v divided by v naught mm. equal to negative bt over m. If you further simplify, you will end up with v equal to v naught e raised to the power negative bt over m and that will be our answer 
The next part of the question says that we need to derive an expression for the distance L that the bullet penetrates into the block as a function of time. We know that V is equal to V naught E negative BT over M, which basically means that dx all divided by dt is equal to V naught E negative bt over m. Hence, dx is equal to v naught e negative bt over m dt. We can integrate, which basically means this would mean that the integral from x naught to x of dx will be equal to v naught the integral from 0 to t of e negative bt over m dt in other words l which is going to be equal to delta x will be equal to e bracket negative m over b bracket e negative bt over m from 0 to t. If we simplify the other side of the equation, L will be equal to m v naught over b minus bracket e negative bt over m minus 1, which means that L is equal to m v naught over b 1 minus e negative bt over n. So the next question, well, this is the end of question number 2.